All right, here's where we're moving on to this. So we're going to take uh, the scalpel. So be very careful, okay? Uh, this one is a little bit rusty, which can happen. It just means that the person didn't dry it very well. So I'm just going to take one of the wipes that I have and just wipe it off a little bit. Okay, I'm not worrying about getting super clean. I'm just going to wipe that off a little bit. So if that happens to you, that's fine. Um, and I may have to swap it out. We'll see how it works. Okay. So what I'm going to want to do is tilt the heart on its side. So this is the left atrium. So you see left ventricle, left atrium. And what I'm going to want to do is start a cut right here. So I'm going to go down through that left atrium. I'm going to go down through that left ventricle. Okay. So I'm going to just make sure that nice and deep in there. I'm going to set the scalpel down. Okay. And I'm going to put my fingers in here and see if I am starting to pull it away. All right. Here it's still held a little tighter. So I'm going to go back and I'm moving my fingers out of the way. See that? I'm going to go back to that area, go down a little bit, set the scalpel down. Okay. All right. That looks better. Okay. Now I'm going to tilt the heart, kind of stand it on its uh, vessels at the top, hold on the side so that I'm not in danger of my fingers, okay? Come around this way, okay? Move slowly with that scalpel, okay? Now that I've gotten over here, tilt it on its side. It's a little easier. Continue cutting like this. Now what I set the scalpel down. Now what I want to do is try to be able to, all right, so see that little part right there? Let's cut that. Okay, still have some held right here. So I'm going to reach again down here with my scalpel. Set the scalpel down. I don't want to try to do both at the same time. Reach in again. Okay. Okay, looks good, because what I want to do is this, open up the heart. So now it's kind of starting to fall away. So what I'm going to do is go in here, kind of slice at those things that are keeping it from opening. Slice it down like this. And there we go. Now we have the heart opened up. Okay. And we're going to be able to see a lot more now. So first, you can see if you feel it inside here, it's kind of slippery, uh, which is important because it's going to need to have the blood flow. Okay. So we have the heart cut open like this. Um, and then we're going to have to do some looking and labeling. Okay. So let's move on to that stuff.